Hi hey, YouTubers, TJ here. This is part two of the diamond snowplow modification to get the slop out of the, the pin areas. I found the culprit. Um, what this is, this is the upper bridle part that pushes on the top of the plow. Fishers don't have this, uh, diamonds do. The newer fishers do have it actually. Well this hole, I guess, was manufactured about 160,000 soft center, over an eighth inch off center. And um, there was a lot of play in it as well, but I'm going to make a bushing that goes in here that's going to have, uh, going to protrude about, oh, I don't know, almost a uh, half inch on each side um, because there was just so much distance between the slot where it goes into. Um, that was causing a lot of slop right there as well. So what I need to do is I need to bore this hole out uh, to almost around two inches and then I have some nice cold rolled 1045 I think that I'm going to machine a bushing out of and weld it in here. Um, this took quite a bit of setup on the bridge port to get it right. Um, what I had to do was make this little little stand here to lean it up against because it is rather big. Uh, I just temporarily welded this onto some some big plate there and bolted it down. I also indicated uh, because I need to find the center this way because again I'm going to be moving it 80 thousandths half of the 160 towards me when I, I'm going to relocate that hole so what I did is I um, took some key stock here and indicated on there and this allows me to get as straight as possible I mean this is a manufactured part nothing straight of course so it allows me to relocate the hole the first thing I'm going to do once I uh, use my coaxial indicator, I'll find the center of the hole. I'll come over 80 thousandths if I have a digital readout. And I'm also going to use an annual cutter to make the first cut. And then the boring bar to bring it up to the final size of what I need. So we're not done yet. Uh, hopefully we'll get this done today. And maybe some welding today. I don't know. We'll see. But thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and also visit my uh, website tjsperformance.com. Thanks for watching.